group of Georgia district attorneys up against the clock to get a judge to toss out a law they argue is unconstitutional. Good evening, and thanks so much for joining us tonight for Fox 5 News at 5. I'm Tom Haynes. I'm Alex Whitler. State legislators passed Senate Bill 92 to create a commission to discipline or remove DAs. That commission is set to form in a little more than a week. Fox 5's Rob Dirienzo was in the courtroom for today's hearing. Rob, what are the takeaways? Well, guys, the judge hasn't issued a ruling yet, but really at the heart of this is whether the state commission can investigate and ultimately remove DAs from office. While some think this will help ensure oversight of DAs, others think that this will help others score political points. An SB 92 is an assault on democracy. It's assault on prosecutor discretion. DeKalb County District Attorney Sherry Boston is one of four DAs suing to stop the commission that would investigate, discipline, or even remove prosecutors. Friday afternoon, their legal team and the state's legal team presented their arguments to a superior court judge. The state's defense was that there's no grounds for the court to intervene because the commission doesn't even exist yet. An injury, in fact, has to be two things, concrete and particularized, and actual or imminent, and this is neither one. But some Democrats think Republican lawmakers intend to use this new commission to play politics, targeting progressive DAs they think are soft on crime, or trying to oust Fulton DA Fonnie Willis after the indictment of former President Donald Trump. So there are already legislators who have vowed come October 1st to file commission complaints against district attorneys here in Georgia for just doing their job, including the DA who works in this very building. Meanwhile, supporters of the law say it would provide needed over Oversight for district attorneys who they think selectively enforce certain laws. While the vote may have been partisan this last time, it is a concept and an idea that has certainly had bipartisan roots. One state lawmaker has already tried to impeach Willis, while another said he'd file a complaint against her for investigating former President Trump, which could lead to her removal under SB 92. And we are optimistic that Judge Whitaker will see the urgency to prevent this commission from interfering with each prosecutor's ability to best represent the members of their community and to pursue safety in the way that their communities elected them to do so. And SB 92 mirrors other laws in states like Florida and Missouri that also seek to remove prosecutors from office. Meanwhile, here in Fulton County, again, the judge has not made a ruling yet, but we do expect one sometime next week before that October 1st deadline. Live in downtown Atlanta, Rob DiRienzo, Fox 5 News. All right, Rob, thanks.